Hello, Frank Church High School. Today is Tuesday, January 10th. This is Tyson and Caleb bringing you today's announcements. Welcome to third quarter. We have a lot of info for you today from our administration, so please listen up. First up is our principal, Mr. Dennis. Good morning, Frank Church. Um, on behalf of our staff, I would like to welcome all of our new st students um, to the spring semester. Um, we couldn't be happier to have you here, um, and we really are proud of our school and hopefully the experience you have. Um, just a few things, and Mrs. Cabina and Mr. Bale are going to talk to you about some of the things um, that we want you to be aware of. For me, um, it's about lunch, and um, last year we went to an open campus, and I, I talked about that on the, the announcement today, but just to kind of clarify, um, 10th graders, 11th graders, and seniors are have an open campus. Um, you need to have your ID card. So a couple things with that. One, if you were here last semester and you do not have your ID card, you have this week to get a new one. Um, everybody is going to have to show an ID card to leave. For those students that are new, you have this week to get an ID card um, for Mrs. Armstrong. Um, and you will be going out the front door. Um, today I saw a couple kids leave from the side. That is a no-go. Um, we want to make sure that we are tracking everybody that's going out the front door. It's a small step. You can do it so you can go have your open campus. Secondly is uh, being respectful in the community. And I touched on it a little bit this morning, but we have multiple campuses around here, younger kids, walking, please be respectful when you get in your car. Don't, you know, burn out of here. Um, I understand you want to go to lunch, but safety is the most important thing. Please be responsible in it. Um, up to this point, there has been no reason to ever take that away in the last year. I do not want to ever do that. Please be responsible. Enjoy your lunch uh, break and uh, be responsible students. But again, welcome to Frank Church. Uh, we are very happy to have you. Thank you, Mr. Dennis. Now let's hear from our vice principals, Mr. Bale and Mrs. Cabina. Hey, Frank Church students. Welcome back to this second semester. I'm Mr. Bale. I am one of the assistant principals um, for Alphabet A through L. Good morning. I am the other assistant principal, and I am Mrs. Cabina, and I am M through Z, but we're both here to be a part of everybody's journey. As we come back this semester, we just have a few reminders. Um, one of the ones I really want to touch base and discuss with you is attendance. We are a really small community, and not only does the administration, but your teachers, they notice when you are not here at school. Um, attendance has such a big impact on the positive relations you build here with your teachers, with your friends, and the impact that it has on your grades. So this semester with our attendance, we're really going to be watching for that attendance and helping you work through that piece and making sure that you have access to school and that you can make it to school. We're going to be watching for that. So. Our challenge to you is, is let's have great attendance this semester. Along with the attendance, let's talk about being in class and being purposeful when we are here at Frank Church. We know that there's a lot of things that happen within a school day, and if you need to use the restroom, you're going to ask permission, but we're going to ask you to be purposeful in your actions in the hallway, that you take care of your business in a manner that gets you back to class super quick, and that when you're outside of the classroom, that your cell phone is left either at your desk or in your bag or within your classroom. So you can do what you need to do and get back to class and get back to learning and get back to being a piece of your classroom community. Um, we know that there's a lot of communication that ha has to happen during the school day. We know that you are all best friends with your parents and every time that you're on your phone you're talking to mom or dad with 100% um, accuracy. I know that's what's happening out there. But mom and dad know that you need to be in class and so we're asking you that you refrain from your cell phone use except for at your time, at break time and at lunches and during passing periods. Um, I hope I covered it. If you have any questions, you know where to find me. Please come down and see me at any time. Again, I'm Mr. Bell. I'm one of the assistant principals, and we're glad to have you back here this semester. Just a few more things, Frank Church. One of the things we want to talk about is that this is a positive community. So we want to make sure that we're paying attention to the words that come out of our mouths, that they're kind and respectful, 
and that our relationships are positive, this is your opportunity to come to school and focus on learning. And that you come to school, you have positive relationships, you keep things positive. If you need help, you go to the appropriate support systems because we're here to support you and love you through your journey. Um, but please go to the appropriate places to get that support if you need it. This is a fresh start for everyone and we want you to come to school to learn and be successful and know that, the, that Frank Church is the best place that you can possibly be. So come to school, focus on you, and we're going to have a great semester. Thank you. Next up is our counselor and student services. Welcome back everyone. We're excited to start a new quarter with you. Um, we are here to talk about groups. Um, your half of your student services team is here. I'm uh, Mrs. Hansen. I am the counselor for students whose last names begin with M through Z. And I am Katie Omertrovich. I'm the college and career counselor. You can call me Mrs. O. I'm Mrs. Weibel and I am the counselor who has students whose last names begin A through L. Ms. Rust and I am the social worker and this time around we are doing groups in eight week increments rather than semester. So when you are signing up for groups you're just going to sign up for the quarter. We at Frank Church alternate when the groups are offered so it will rotate each week. You don't miss the same class every day. It is during the school day um, offered here on site. So you'll be given the survey of how you can choose which group you would like to be in during your pathways class. You can only pick one and even if you don't want to join a group, you do need to complete the survey. Everyone will complete it. You'll just say you're not interested in a group. Even if you did a group last quarter, you will still um, need to complete the sign up again during pathways. And if you've never joined a group here at Frank, we highly encourage you to give it a try. Uh, they're a lot of fun. The groups are run by the student services and they are support groups to help you guys get through stuff that you get, you're get you going through on a daily basis. Um, if you want to try a group out and then you decide it's not for you, it's no big deal. We can always take you out of the group later. So I encourage you to give it a shot. Um, we would love to see you there. If you have any questions, come let us know. Here is the QR code for you all to scan with your phones. Teachers, please pause your videos while everyone fills out the form.
And last is Miss McDougall with the ski trip information. Hey, Frank Church students! We get to have our first since 2016 ski and snowboard trip up to Bogus Basin. This trip is going to be open to any student who earned a grade of C or better last quarter. So if that's you, and if you're interested, you need to get from either myself in room 211 or your mentor teacher a liability form. This is going to sign off saying that you release any liability from Bogus Basin if you get hurt or injured. Um, but aside from that, it's a lot of fun. This is open to all abilities. What you get is you get a free lesson, um, and then you get a chance to ski for a little bit before we have a bus take you back down to school. This, is, this trip is going to be Thursday, January 26. If you're interested, get your permission slips today because I have to have them back in by Thursday, this Thursday. Um, so in this packet, I've got them. Your mentor teachers will have them. There's your permission slip your guardian needs to fill out. Um, your possessions are going to be searched by a, a Boise police dog just to make sure you're not bringing any paraphernalia some suggestions on how to dress and if you are in need of any equipment there is a checklist here for you to let us know what kind of equipment you need clothing wise um, rentals will be available for skis and snowboards so if you're interested make sure your grades are up get your permission slip in by thursday we will have a second trip in february for those students earning a grade of c or better for this quarter thanks Thank you. Remember, this is a free trip for those of you who have good grades last quarter. Thanks for watching. Have an excellent day, Frank Church. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.